negative thoughts, words, pictures. You must recognize that negative information coming to your brain is an enemy. And if you don't recognize it, if you're not aware of it, if you don't do something to counteract it, the, you're listening to negativity, will then eventually get into your thoughts. And as it starts developing in your thoughts, then the Bible says it can enter your heart. Once it enters your heart, it puts down roots. Once it puts down roots, it will produce something. It's going to produce a crop. And so when the Bible and Jesus said, take no thought for tomorrow, he, he's trying to say to you, if, if you start hearing negative things about tomorrow, if you start thinking about negative things tomorrow, and you dwell on them until they finally take root, they'll get into your heart. And once they get into your heart, they'll put down a root system. What's a root system do? It finds what it needs to produce a crop. And literally, once you take a negative thought or an evil thought, and those roots go into your heart, you, those roots will actually, just like roots of a plant, will go out through the rocks, through the concrete, through everything to get what it needs. It's, roots are amazing to me because if you actually could pull the roots out of everything, you, you just, it's an incredible network with incredible power to get what it wants. And literally, in our life, that works in this way. It will start drawing certain people to you. It will start drawing certain information to you. It goes out and finds the nutrients it needs to produce whatever it is. And if it's a negative thing, it's out to produce a negative fruit in your life. And sometimes people think, well, man, it's just supernatural that I met that person. Yeah, it was supernatural, but it was not of God. It was a wrong thought that you've took into your heart, and now it's going to work really hard to produce an evil result. And so we're not aware of that, and that's why Jesus taught the parable about the sower souls of the word, uh, because he said you've got to be careful what you listen to, and you've got to understand because this is the way the whole kingdom works. I'm not here to talk about all that per se, but I'm just saying negative, negative things, thoughts, images, and et cetera, have an agenda, and they want to take you out. And so he said, take no thought.